yeah welcome a new video against an international master here from um, Venezuela you don't have that too often so um on a rural pass so what line a player all kinds of lines against the Rui that's um okay <laughs> the exchange yeah knight c3 knight c3 yeah there's um a bunch of possible answers here i go queen f6 this is um somewhat um underestimated move also on uh, castles okay just take it it's um it looks like black has lost the tempo and uh, in fact this is true i am um, i really am a tempo one move down on um, on some line but uh, fortunately this line that um, I'm lacking a tempo to in comparison is relatively harmless so um, f5 was uh, one idea but this is not working at the moment hmm. yeah this is the one problem with this um, position positions is that it, it is very uh, very tedious to play sometimes you need to be rather patient there's not so much um, threatening or, or, or dangerous happening but you can easily um, overlook some some small detail and then you're really into trouble it can uh, it can happen here for instance um, he's trying to to double on the d-file and um, it looks like he might manage this how to um, set up the pieces here I really um, I really would like to exchange one rook one pair of rooks mm, yeah okay maybe this way Bishop e7 now wins maybe a tempo but okay he's got knight to d5 Mm, this is a problem. Okay, maybe I need to be <coughs> need to be um, a bit um, a bit cautious. And also, uh, yeah, need to be rather modest as black you don't really have uh, have much you can do um, okay this defense uh, c7 and so on and um, I have this way to to free my position a bit it, uh, it looks nice for white but uh, it's not so evident how how he's going to continue now one idea that I have is knight e5 to c4, which would be very strong if I really would manage to get uh, get the knight to c4. He's got a very bad knight on b3, so this is his main main problem. Yeah, he's taking a bit of a time out. It's not easy. This um, b3 knight is, is, yeah, it's really tricky, tricky position. But um, I don't think this really could can trouble me. I think yeah. exchanging one pair of rooks must be must be helpful. The question now is knight e5 or, or some other move. Rook e8, yeah, rook e8 would, would win a tempo. He has um, bishop. Oh wait, wait, wait! Just, 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 just bishop g5, of course. Just bishop g5. Bishop g5, f4, knight takes f4. Hmm. 
Yeah. I had this idea before, Bishop G5, and um, <laughs> just I forgot about it. So, um, okay, he's uh, giving up the exchange. Now bishop to e6, yeah, this is nice. The bishop now is on a very good post. Um, knight f4 or knight e5. Knight e5 looks looks good to c4 or to d3. This uh, further exchanges. Check. Check. Yeah, it's um, it's an exchange, and he's um, got those those weaknesses. How to do this? Um, let's go here, and then possibly um, enter with the rook. Also, of course, c six and b five is um, something that would help me. So advance here. Let's try to go all the way to b4 if possible. Uh, rook d8 also would have been good, yeah. but I can still do that. Rook d3, he cannot go to c3 really, rook d3. And rook d3 next move is really strong. Attacks the bishop and uh, the pawn here. Yeah, see that this bishop is always dominating the knight. This is this is important. It makes uh, the technical task easier. Now just Check. grab the g2 pawn, and uh, I still have all those this, this those uh, those uh, pawns. Yeah, b2. It's not uh, not instantly winning. I can also use the c pawn. In addition, yeah. Now the bishop. We'll go to to e4 and also got an h pawn now so it's uh, rather comfortable only 28 seconds give uh, yeah. give white some some slight hopes okay so knight, knight d4 huh? mm -hmm. Yeah, eleven seconds. <laughs> it's not uh, not too much. Check. 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 Yeah, what now? Let the clock run down. Yeah, I didn't uh, choose the most efficient way, but <laughs> it's sometimes really weird. I don't know what people are doing. 
why not just uh, resign and got, get on with the next game or whatever. <clears throat> He might play a move at two seconds or so. It happens. White forfeits on time. Yeah, no idea. I don't. I don't really know what. Did I do something to to uh, provoke him or whatever? Instead, besides winning, I mean, yeah. Okay. And this at some point it looked really uh, really nice for White. This kind of position. I don't know. It looked it looked better for White, but maybe there's not much happening. It it's sometimes de deceptive. And uh, really quickly, um, it, it was it was a problem. F five. Okay. This already is uh, is quite nice for black. Um, <laughs> the computer gives plus one point seven for black. This is cool. Yeah, I mean, okay, uh, two bishops, and he's got he's got bad knights on b three. In d five, I mean, it's not a bad knight. It looks nice on d five, but what it is doing, what? What exactly is um, the role of this piece? Yeah, very quickly he got into into decisive problems here. I could have won much quicker, I'm sure, but um, I think it was uh, sufficiently uh, effective. I mean, it, he didn't really have a chance to to save. All right, thanks for watching.